Welcome to the MBS Engineering channel. Today, we will be discussing how to calculate the diameter of a driven pulley and understand the concept of the pulley speed ratio. We will cover these topics in the upcoming slides. First, let's learn about the pulley speed ratio formula. It is represented as d1 multiplied by n1 is equal to d2 multiplied by n2. Where, d1 is the diameter of the driving pulley. d2 is the diameter of the driven pulley. n1 is the speed of the driving pulley. n2 is the speed of the driven pulley. The pulley's rotational speeds, n1 and n2, are measured in revolutions per minute, rpm. Next, let's understand how to calculate the diameter of a driven pulley using the pulley speed ratio formula. For this, we need to consider the following data as per the snaps. D1 is 200 mm, diameter of the driving pulley. N1 is 3600 rpm, speed of the driving pulley. N2 is 1500 rpm, speed of the driven pulley. D2 is unknown, diameter of the driven pulley. Now, let's use the pulley speed ratio formula to calculate D2. D1 multiplied by N1 is equal to D2 multiplied by N2. Substituting the known values, we get, 200 mm into 3600 rpm equals D2 into 1500 rpm. Solving for D2, we get, D2 equals 200 mm multiplied by 3600 rpm, obtained value divided by 1500 rpm, then, D2 equals 480 mm. Therefore, the diameter of the driven pulley is 480 mm. Thank you for watching. I hope this explanation has helped you understand the pulley speed ratio formula and how to calculate the diameter of a driven pulley using it.